Seven most effective tips for writing a better scientific research paper. Writing a scientific journal is not an easy task. Scientific papers require high standard writing skills, considering that they are going to be referred by students, academicians, and aspiring scientists. However, not all scientific papers are good as we expect them to be. Many researchers struggle to communicate their research results. Let's look at the seven most effective tips for writing a better scientific research paper and keep watching the video. Number one, keep your title direct to the point and avoid being too technical. The title is the first thing that editors will see in your paper. Hence, your title must accomplish the four goals of an ideal title for a scientific paper. Number one, the title should summarize the content. Number two, it must be catchy rather than boring. Number three, it must be coherent with the tone of your paper. Number four, it should contain keywords for such engine optimization. Second, start writing your abstract only after you finish writing your paper. The abstract contains a summary of your paper and which is why it's easier to write it after you finish your conclusion. For a better abstract, it's important to keep it short but complete. Your abstract should contain the heart of your research paper that includes a short paragraph about your research problem, research method and your conclusion. Number three, Put the most important details of your scientific paper in the introduction. Don't confuse the introduction with the abstract. The introduction provides the context and the rationale of your work before presenting the research problem. It should include all the necessary details such as the scope, context, significance of your study and the research methods used. Keep it simple. A good introduction will let know the readers why they should read the paper. Number four, always connect the discussion of your results to the introduction. Your discussion must show an interpretation and definitely a description of your findings. It shouldn't be a repetition of the introduction. And you should be able to explain how you came up with a solution to your research problem. What methods have you used to gather the data? What were the challenges you have encountered during the experiments? You may include graphs, figures, images to illustrate the important details and highlight the notable implications. Number five, always update your reference section and make sure to include all the resources you have used to write your scientific paper. Just a tip so you won't omit any importance reference. Make a habit to take note of your resources as you write your research paper. The reference section only comes at the end of your research. So it's very easy to forget whatever resources you may have used before. Number six, utilize quotations in your scientific paper 
to strengthen your arguments and improve its aesthetic appeal. Some statements are better said in their original form. Specifically, when referring to lengthy paragraphs from popular scientific authors. If you think paraphrasing an original work would diminish its meaning, then use quotations in your paper. It creates an interesting appeal in your research paper. Other examples of quotable items are questions from empirical papers, measurements, scientific or political quotes, and relevant opinion other authors. Number seven, avoid fillers. If you want to write a powerful statement and a meaningful scientific paper, the number of word count required for scientific papers sometimes tempts researchers to use fillers. Fillers are apparently meaningless words or phrases that are added to a research paper just to make it lengthy. Fillers can diminish the quality of a scientific paper. So after drafting your paper, always remember to revise it for correctness. Consider validating data and reviewing figures. For the best results, have it edited and definitely proofread by professionals to comply with the required standards. A final tip, write to inform and not just to impress. If you have any related questions, leave a comment in the comment box below. We would love to answer them. Do refer to the link given below for more details and don't forget to subscribe to Biotechnica channel and hit the bell icon. Until then, keep learning.